All right, hello everybody. Josh here for Lofty Sites. We're gonna do a quick video today on how to install WordPress from your cPanel. Uh, while some of this information is specific to Lofty Sites customers, uh, if you have access to a cPanel and one-click installations, this process is gonna be pretty much the same across the board. So to get started, you're gonna type in your domain name. Um, in this instance, we're gonna use weberg.com um, as an example. If you have, obviously you'll have a different domain name, so you go forward slash cPanel, and that'll take you into your da -da -da -da, cPanel. All right, uh, next, I'm just gonna go ahead and copy paste these credentials in here. And once you're in, success. You can say, no thanks, I'm fine, because I'm watching a tutorial on how to do this instead, so you don't need any help. You can go ahead and scroll down. We're gonna go all the way down to Software and Services, Quick Install. So quick click and quick install, say that 10 times fast. And let's see here, one click install, scroll down. Install WordPress this last pass notification out of the way by the way last pass it's good check it out install WordPress from the drop-down menu go ahead and just choose uh, your domain name if you want to add you know install it somewhere else most likely you're, you're not gonna want to do that uh, let's see here uh, go ahead and put in an admin email blog title can be the name of your business or if this is your personal website just put in your name but whatever you want the website to be called its main title uh, I think I'll just make it Weberg user admin or admin user um, it's important here that it's just letters and numbers no spaces special characters or anything like that so just go ahead and enter your first and last name install WordPress and here you can if you want to browse themes obviously feel free to do that I'm gonna click no and you can see here your install is running boom done install complete so hopefully this will open in a new tab let's see boom yes and then uh, we'll just copy in our username and password and yeah go ahead and try to get into this because I will either have changed it or I don't really care so once you're in BAM this is what WordPress looks like if you are new to WordPress um, this is the back end if you want to see what it looks like the front end what everybody else sees uh, just go ahead and go up to your website name here and click visit website but wait we just signed up for this account now this is obviously specific to lofty sites users if you know you're with somebody else and they do things differently so you can probably just go ahead and stop this video now but for us um, we have this uh, placeholder page basically which if you know you hadn't installed anything yet and there wasn't anything to show on your website we don't really want to be exposing your file system to the world so there's a placeholder page here and so what we can do if we want to go ahead and get rid of that oops uh, we can go back to our cPanel and scroll down to files file manager we can go to the web root so make sure that's selected here so within this folder it is important note this uh, it is the index.html not the index.php so this is the one and instead of erasing it I'll just go ahead and rename it so let's just say index renamed.html and you can see that is now renamed and if we go back to our website and refresh it we can see that we have successfully installed WordPress. So that's it for this video. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, of course, reach out to us at support at loftysites.com. 
And if you just sign up for your account and you're trying to figure out how to get going, uh, just shoot us an email and we can actually go ahead and just do this process for you. So as always, thank you for listening and hope you have a great day. Thanks.